Hey everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'll be showing you how to use Firebase push notifications in React Native. But before we dive in, hit that like button and subscribe for more awesome content. Let's get started. As you can see I have already created a simple demo project with two components home and setting. First, create a Firebase project I'll name it Firebase push notification. Now, let's look at the documentation for React Native Firebase Cloud Messaging. We need to install two packages, React Native Firebase slash app and React Native Firebase slash messaging. Next, we need to add permissions for iOS and Android for notifications. Import the required packages, create a function to handle permissions, and retrieve the FCM token. Open your Firebase console, click on the Android icon, add a package name, and continue. Go to the Project Settings, then the Cloud Messaging tab. While it's loading, let's go back to the documentation. In the Receive section, click on Notification. There are several methods to create notifications. One is server-side implementation, where you use the token to send notifications to specific users. You can also use REST API for this use the same link, just change the project ID to your project ID. Let's use some demo code with modifications to handle notifications and navigate to a specific screen. Adjust the navigation IDs accordingly as the data comes in double quoted strings. We won't be using the post section so you can delete it.
In the configuration, remove initial root name and set the initial root to home in the stack navigator. Install the required packages. The command is in the description. Now add the background handler and foreground handler in the subscribe function. Back in the Firebase console, enable the Cloud Messaging API legacy. Once enabled, download the Google Services.json file and add it to the app folder. Don't forget to add the plugin and ClassPath in the app and Android folders build.gradle files. Start the React Native server. If you encounter issues like not receiving the FCM token or service not available errors, try running flash gradloop clean in the Android folder and restarting the app. If you're using an emulator, close and restart it. Navigate to the Firebase console. Click on Cloud Messaging under Project Overview, then create a Firebase notification message with a title and body. In additional details, add key navigation ID and value settings. Enable the sound. Review and publish the message. The notification will take a few minutes to come.
As you can see, clicking on the notification navigates to the settings screen. And there you have it. Integrating Firebase push notifications into your React Native app is now a breeze. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more exciting content. Happy coding!